What is up, my YouTube people? Um, it is. Let's see, it is one thirty-nine in the morning here on the East Coast. I don't know how long I'll have you with me. My phone is uh pretty low, but you know. They say if you want to do vlogs and stuff, record everything you do in your life. So I am 1.39 a.m. in the morning. I'm drinking a cup of coffee and I am preparing dinner for tomorrow. I know, crazy, right? But that's what we do here on the East Coast. We cook at, you know, 2 o'clock in the freaking morning. Why the hell not, right? Why the hell not? You got your coffee? I hope so. It's good. It's real good. Matter of fact, uh, let me um, kind of warm up. That's cool. I'm sorry about that noise that you hear. It's just let me know my battery's low. And my charger is in the other room. And I am got my hands knee deep. No, ain't that a damn saying. My hands knee deep. Anyways, I got my knuckle deep in noodles. So. I am making a very simple macaroni salad recipe. Now I've done cooked the noodles and I've got my burner set on warm uh, just to keep it warm because I'm going to keep my noodles warm until I can get them all drained and cooled. Um, as you can see, I've got them in a the strainer here. Letting them kind of drain a little bit, a little at a time. Now, some people like their noodles like really white, and that's okay. I prefer them to be a little, little darker, you know, a little tint dark to it. Um, just because, I mean, I don't want them hard. Hell no, I mean, you know, not everybody likes hard things, my peeps. Anyways, another conversation. So, we're letting them cool, running this, you know, cold water over them. And I've had people say, like, why do you, you want your noodles to cool, but you keep them warm on the oven? I don't have them turned on. I'm not cooking them. I just want to keep them warm while the other ones, you know, um, get cool because I don't want them to get, like, really hard and soggy and stuff. And if you keep them warm on the oven, if you keep your burner on warmer not on low not on medium or anything like that but just on warmer where you can keep your noodles warm it'll stop them from sticking together and being soggy and messy while the other ones are you're cooling but it doesn't take that long to cool them so you just want to get really down in there and kind of you know keep them cool and stuff and i should have grabbed the damn bigger strainer but fuck you know my hard ass has to do everything the hard way. But my noodles are pretty cool in there, so. We're gonna continue to add hot noodles to it. Ain't that some shit? Usually, guys, I would stra I would change strainers. I would put my cooler noodles. I don't know why I'm doing everything half-ass backwards today. But I would keep my cooler noodles in another pot. But I don't feel like washing all these dishes at two o'clock in the morning, so. Kinda doing everything the hard ass way. But, um, yeah, so. We're cooling noodles. Now, I use, I like to use, now you can use all kinds of noodles, um, but let me tell you. Some people like the little noodles when they're cooking um, macaroni salad or whatever, because we're having like all kinds of shit tomorrow. We're just throwing stuff together, and I'll show you here in a minute. But I like to use uh, the Maslonian. Uh, the la ma, malasana, I guess that's how you pronounce it, malasana uh, shells. Um, these are not expensive. They're pretty freaking cheap. Um, it's a, and it says a product of Italy. You can make any damn thing you want with these guys. These things are freaking delicious, and they swell big like they get really big so you ladies who like really big things voila there you go um let me see 
I just wanted to kind of give you, um, they are, um, they're a healthier choice of noodle. Um, like this is the, it's got the, uh, the vegan check. Um, let's see. And they last like a very long freaking time. Um, see, it's just wheat. Um, they're, you know, just maybe it contains wheat, um, maybe a little bit of soy, it says. Um, but yeah, there's not a whole lot of, uh, the carbohydrates is 15, you know, percent, 40 grams. Um, there's no sodium whatsoever in these, and that's rare for, um, noodles. But these are actually a healthier choice. Uh, it says stone and grind. Um, it only takes about 13 minutes to cook these. Something like that. Maybe 15. Doesn't take long at all to cook them. Uh, it's 100% uh, durum wheat uh, enriched macaroni product. So it's a bronze dye. Um, and it does say right there, as you can see, product of Italy. See? Product of Italy. And you can see the little vegan check right there. Um, but yeah, dude, uh, this shit right here is it's, it's, it's some good shit. Um, like I said, they're, they're, they're not uh, that all expensive. Uh, I can't remember how to much I got a whole cabinet full of them I just because when I make homemade macaroni or anything like that I use these because these are one of my favorite product uh a noodles product um ever so get these guys they're healthier for you um like I said they they uh they don't have all that trans fat they do have you know like I said 40 grams of carbohydrates um it's got 7%, 2 grams of de uh, fiber, um, no sugar, um, and that included uh, added sugar. There's no sugar. And it says the total fat, you know, is uh, 1 gram. Nine calories is 190 if you count calories. So, um, yeah, these are, uh, these, these are fresh, picked. Uh, cooked noodles and shipped here. I'm telling you, you will love these noodles if you've never tried them. So, uh, if you want the name of, of these noodles or etc., just uh, drop a comment below and I will write them in there for you. So, there you go. Damn lesson on fucking noodles. Okay, so our noodles are are cooling. They are cooling uh, fairly well, actually, pretty quick. And the reason I'm cooking it this late is because a lot of people um, don't know, realize that, you know, I like macaroni and salad cold. And so, therefore, I cook it the night before to sit it in the refrigerator so it can be good and cool. Now, I don't add everything to it the night before, like my um, salad cubes and etc. Now, I will go ahead and put my onion in it and my mayonnaise and stuff like that in it. And let it cool and then I'll add the rest of my stuff that um, eggs and etc etc tomorrow because um, we're gonna do uh, just do like a little vegetable day tomorrow um, and I'll show you because we have our pintos cooking in the crock pot y'all how many of you love fucking crock pot pintos especially with a big ass handball and I'm getting ready to show you that so this was a handball we had uh, a while back and we froze and um, it's gonna be delicioso, I promise. You guys can come and eat. I think you'll love it and enjoy it. So, noodles are cooling. Um, we'll go ahead and get our burner turned off now. Yeah, that pot's still a little fucking hot. <laughs> Word. Hell yeah. Damn, that burnt the hell out of me. But anyways. Praise the Lord. Thank God for it. Thank God we got to eat.
But, um, so yeah, we're making a macaroni salad. And so, how's you guys' days been? I like to hear from you guys. I, it's been a while since I've got to even post or do anything because I've had a lot going on the past few months. Um, so, I've had to take a hold on uh, social media and, uh, you know, my podcast and all that. But we're good. We're, we're back. So, we're doing a new series on our podcast. Uh, we've got new episodes coming out. Matter of fact, we got a new episode coming up this Friday at the Just Saying Podcast. Make sure you're following us on Facebook. Um, the link is Just Saying. Uh, I had to put the link in this. I'll put the link in the video for the uh, Facebook page. And um, you can also get it. Just look up Just Saying. Uh, Spotify, Apple Podcast, uh, iHeartRadio. It's all on all those platforms wherever you get your podcast you can find it so yeah we got that coming on we got new shirts and stuff coming out guys go to my instagram at james Edwards music um and click in the link in the bio and look at the shirt that we got out it says i'm freaking awesome guys you're gonna want to start getting these shirts we got a lot more coming out you're gonna love it it's 20 bucks you can't beat it um, and, um, you can get it in different colors, I think, uh, the one it's showing is, uh, pink and black, maybe, or pink and white, uh, man or female, they come in all different sizes, you can get some hats just like it, you can get whatever you want, so just put your order in, if you want to order something different, and you want us to make something special for you, we can do that too, so, um, just drop us a comment, follow us on Instagram and let us know, I'm trying to get this done before... I lose you guys uh, as far as the video wise goes. So, all right. So our noodles are all cool. I like to get my hands down in there, and I usually wouldn't touch my phone. Um, so make sure you always keep your hands good and washed when you're cooking. That's the main thing. Hygiene, especially in this day and time with this damn shit going on with this fake ass virus or whatever it's going on. Maybe it's real, maybe it's not, I don't know, but anyways, if you've had it, I'm sorry, and I hope that you're the best, and if you haven't had it, you know, most importantly is do what's best for you. If you feel that it's real and you feel like you need to get vaccinated, please do so. And if you feel like, um, you know, you don't need to be vaccinated, but maybe you do just for the sake of others. Go ahead and get vaccinated. We've all done it. I mean, we've all had our shots. So go get vaccinated. And, um, you know, yeah. So take care of yourself. Take care of others around you. Mm. Nothing like a good cup of coffee at 3 o'clock in the morning. So, noodles are cool. I am going to go ahead and add my mayonnaise tonight. I want to save my Duke mayonnaise for... I don't feel like going to the grocery store. So, I'm going to use the real mayonnaise for the... This tastes the same, but the Duke I like better with the deviled eggs, which we are having as well. And I'd like to know your recipe on what you do, how you do these things. But I do something... I just do simple stuff. And that's what I like about these little shows I do on YouTube. Excuse me. It's just little simple recipes. Now you can add whatever it is you want to your macaroni salad. You can add whatever you want, you, you know, however you want to fix it is how you want to do it. But let me show you guys this. Let's see if I can turn. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Delicioso, my friends. See our noodles are there. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Tell me that doesn't make you want to, mm. That is a big ass ham bone. And it is going to be tasty with these pintos. Our pintos are doing good. We washed them, of course. Picked up all the bad ones, got them out. And as you can see, they are cooking and will be cooking all night. So I cannot wait to dig in that. And my grandma is coming to make corn, homemade cornbread. So yes, 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 yes. No. How many of you love homemade cook 
I know I do. I know it's just driving the hell out of me. I know. It's just letting me know that I'm recording, but I, my battery's done, so. Okay. So we're probably going to use this whole thing of mayonnaise. Because <laughs> it is a lot of noodles. And I probably shouldn't have fixed so much for just two people. <laughs> but, hell. That's just usually how it goes. And I might even need more mayonnaise, so. It takes a lot of mayonnaise to make. Now, you know, uh, I have been known to add chicken to my macaroni salad. You know, like the canned chicken. Guys, it's not that bad. Like, I was not, I was very skeptical at first. Like, I was like, fuck no. Hell, and I ain't eating nothing out of a can like that. But, uh, my mom's done been over here because the damn cake chicken's gone. Every time she's that can of chicken gets in here, it's, it doesn't last but a second. That shit's like gone. So, but uh, yeah. Anyways, it comes in a can kind of like this, and it says white old chicken. This is um, my uh, menace clams. I don't eat this shit, but they do. They love it. Um. So yeah. I was trying to, I thought we had several cans of it. I guess they have demolished it. That shit does not last long here. Oh, wait a minute. I might be wrong. Yes, we do have one can. I'm not adding it, I'm not adding it tonight, but anyways. Uh, yeah, this white chicken in a can, guys, I'm telling you. At first, I was like, hell no. There's no way I'm eating chicken out of a can. Because I'm really, like, I'm very uh, weird or particular when it comes to my meats, when it comes to my food. And I don't do a lot of stuff out of cans. Um, but, because I was raised, my grandmother raised me, and everything we made was homemade or fresh, you know, whatever. But this, guys, is amazing. I cannot tell you how much, I mean, really, to be damn chicken in a fucking can is amazing. And you can't add this to your macaroni salad. Um, but then it comes like chicken salad, I guess. But hell, who knows? Anyways, yeah. So we're adding our mayonnaise. Now you can, add, you know, you'll add your salad pickles and all that stuff, you know, whatever you want to put in it. You can dice up uh, dill pickles. I'm not big on pickles, I'm not a pickle fan. Now the salad cubes I will do um, for the macaroni style because the mayonnaise takes the texture and the flavor out of the pickle. Let's warm my coffee up. Look at that mayonnaise on my damn cup, y'all. So yeah. Mmm. Nothing like a good black cup of coffee. Like them like I like my women, y'all. Alright, so. Gonna mix this up real good. Now you can get in here with your hands, which is usually what I would do, but because I'm online, kind of want to just let you guys know. You kind of can't. I, I don't have my damn uh, <laughs> tripod, tripods, and all that stuff. My lights with me tonight, so kind of making the hard things a little adjustable to see. So, but yeah, I'm mixing them up. And everything up. So yeah, I'm about to lose you guys. So look, I will let you know how it comes out, and I'll show you the secret. Re I'll show you the rest of it when it comes. Uh, the next step I'm gonna do, because my phone is about to die, is I'm gonna add onions. I use a half an onion. Um, for two bags of that, I use only a half because the onion can be very strong. So, um, a half an onion, uh, a whole jar of salad cubes, and salt and pepper, uh, some boiled eggs, uh, cut and stick on top around. I'll show you the finished product when it's done, okay? But until then, I love you guys. Thank you for your support. Please go to my Instagram and follow. Please subscribe and hit that down button. It's hot and turn on that little notification bell. So you'll know when I'm alive or when I'm around, when I'm posting new stuff. I love you. I thank you for your support. I've got some great content coming up you don't want to miss.
Hasta luego. Adios. Buenos noches, my friends. Peace, y'all.